So hey everyone, welcome back to my new video. Today I am going to show you, 3 trendy background animation techniques, in a light motion. So let's start the video. To make this background animation, click on plus icon, and add rectangle shape. Then click on this 3 dots above, and select stretch to composition area. To make it full screen. Then extend this layer as long you want, but I will extend this layer to 6 seconds. Now go to color and fill option. And here select any color according to your choice. I will select this white color. Then click on layer icon, and make a duplicate layer. Now select this duplicate layer, go to color and fill option. And here select any different color according to your choice. I will select this red color. Then go to move and transform. And move this layer to left side, like this. Now to make the stripes, we will go to effects and add stripes effect. Here first enable punch out option. Then enable screen space option. Change count value to 3.6. And change angle value to 140 degree. Then select width, add keyframe at starting. And change width value to 1. Then go 10 frames forward, and add keyframe. And here change width value to 0.50. After that go to speed curve, and make curve like this. To make this animation smooth. Now to animate this stripes. Select phase, go to starting and add keyframe. Then go to ending, and add keyframe. And here increase phase value as you want. But I will keep the value to around 4. Then we will add in another effect, called tiles effect. Open Tiles effect. And enable Mirror option, to mirror this animation. Now our background animation is ready, so let's preview it. And we will get this cool animation. Now let's move to next background animation. To make this wave background animation, click on plus icon, and add rectangle shape. Then click on this three dots, and select stretch to composition area. To make it full screen. Then extend this layer as long you want. Now go to color and fill option. And select white color. Then click on this layer icon, and make a duplicate layer. Now select this duplicate layer, go to color and fill option. And select any different color according to your choice. Now we will make the lines. For that go to effects. First add tiles effect. And enable mirror option. Then add another effect called stripes effect. Open Stripes effect, and enable Punch Out option, then enable Screen Space option. Change Smoothing value to 0. Then change Count value to around 12. And change Width value to 0.04. Now we will make the Wave animation. For that add Wave Wrap effect. Open Wave Wrap effect, and change Angle value to around 204 degree. Decrease spacing value to around 18.5. Change wrap angle to minus 180 degree. And enable screen space option. Then select phase, and add keyframe at starting. Then go to ending, and add keyframe. And here increase phase value as you want. But I will keep the value to around 2.50. Now our background animation is ready, so let's preview it. And we will get this animation. Now let's move to next background animation. To make this grid background animation, I have already added this shape layer, just to save your time. First we will make the gradient color, for that select this layer. Then go to effects, and add gradient overlay effect.
Here click on color 1, and select any color according to your choice. Then click on color 2, and select any different color. Scroll down, and change alpha value to 100%. And change angle value to 76 degree. To rotate this gradient. After that go back. Click on this layer option, and make a duplicate layer. Now select this duplicate layer, go to color and fill option. And here select black color. Then go to effects, and delete this gradient overlay effect. Now to make the grid lines, we will add grid effect. Here change spacing value to around 0.84. Change width value to around 0.2. Then enable this screen space option. And change grid color to white. Now to animate this grid, add offset. Open offset. Add keyframe at starting. Then go to ending, and add keyframe. And here change x offset value as you want. But I will keep the value to around 300. Then go to Blending, and change Blending Mode to Screen, so that we can see our gradient background. And also decrease Opacity to around 30. Now our background animation is ready, so let's preview it. And we will get this cool grid background. You can also download this backgrounds for free. Check the download link given in description. If you are watching this video till now, then don't forget to like this video and leave a comment below. Also if you are new to my channel then don't forget to subscribe my channel. And press the bell icon to get notified. I will see you in my next video, till then bye.